This is BattleBit. And it's the casual super lobby shooter we want. This <laughs> is so dope, bro. We got a heli! Find him up! All right, soldier. You're not dying on me. Not today. Appreciate you. That's no, good. That's what I like to hear. Soldier. I'm going. Oh, we're outside. Check this out. <laughs> but what really takes this epic game to the next level is... Yes! Yes! The community. You guys are just dropping. You alright? Saw you take a tumble there, pasta. That was a pretty far jump. I might not want to try that again, alright? Hey, 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 pick me up, dog. Pick me up, pussy. No, no, not me. No, that wasn't me. Oh, God, help. Yeah, pick him up. Yeah, no. yeah, get his ass. Where are you taking me? Oh, they got me in a room. Oh, what is he doing? Oh, no. Oh! I'll miss your shot, boy. Yeah, you missed. You missed, didn't you? Yeah, you missed again. You missed again. Oh, that one. I that can one tell. Yeah, I can. hey. Hey! Come with me, brother. I'm bringing you to your buddy. I'm bringing you to your friend. Tell him not to shoot. Okay. Come All right. Oh, I might die. All right. Don't shoot. Away. Don't shoot. He's taking me. Friendly. 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 But in all seriousness, the social interactions in this game can be just downright hilarious to something magical as you form a bond with your brothers in the trenches in these giant wars and the stories you forge together. Whatever happens, I love you all. They're already sniping us, boys. Into battle! Let's get to the bridge. Now push onward. Hold the bridge! Let's go! <laughs> oh, I've been hit. Oh, oh, someone. Anyone. I'm over here. Yes. Yes. No. Come back. Oh, thank you. Doctor, I've been, I've been having like a crazy rash in my leg. What does that mean? Oh, yeah, I would get that checked out immediately. I'm not gonna touch it though. Throw your nades! Throw your nades! Dude, this is a shit show. This is so absurd. Watch out, grenade! Oh, I'm seeing the light, boys. I'm seeing the light. Throw your grenades, boys! I'm going fast. Get that man up! Don't go towards the light! Oh, I wanna go! Oh, I'm back here in this hellscape. No! Why didn't you let me go? Get out of here! Get up! Get up! They're right here! They're right on the other side! I got him! I got him! I got him! They're right here! Throwing smoke! Oh, Throw your grenade! Throw your grenade! Oh, I need you! Two, three! Punch up! Keep moving! Keep moving! Keep pushing! Whether you won the battle or lost the war, the real victory is in the friends you made along the way. All right, we gotta go D this way. You can't take the bridge. It's too dangerous. I died too many times on that bridge. But you really have to hand it to Sergeant Okie Doki. With just three developers on the team and seven years in development, this game couldn't have had a better launch, in my opinion. All of this just works. I'm not kidding. It dropped with <laughs> hardly any bugs. Hey, We're all on top of each other. What the? Everybody making the same noise at the same time. Ready, go. Uh, 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 that's not a bug. 
that's just charm. Honestly, everything surrounding this game is very lighthearted, but there's so much depth to it as well. And some of my favorite things about it are how clean the game feels overall. The movement's great, the gunplay's great, and I really don't recall any kind of lag or desync taking place whatsoever. And one of the biggest things that I love that I'm starting to see more in games like this and the finals is destruction. Oh no, they don't like me. Oh, sorry, buddy. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. It blew my mind the first time a building collapsed in front of me. Oh, shit. They're, they're all back. They're all back. Building's coming down. Get out, boys. Get out. Get out, Joker. Get out. The ground starts rumbling and everyone starts panicking and just jumping out of the way. And when some things fall apart and walls go down, you have the resources to build cover back up, which leads to the classes. All of them feel useful. And I actually love playing support for the fact of building. No, this isn't crazy over the top Fortnite building. This is very simple, but very useful at times. Uh, sandbags, walls, and things like that. That can literally save someone's life. And speaking of saving someone's life, something you've seen plenty in this video already, but dragging people. It is beyond awesome to have this in the game. It truly is a staple of battle bit to me. There's been so many instances where I've saved or been saved by teammates because they were able to drag me from the battlefield into a safer place before reviving me. I remember this one instance, one of my buddies went down and I pulled him out of the way just before a tank came barreling through and we both would have gotten squashed if I just sat there to revive him. Along with the death comms and overall local proximity chat, it really just adds together to make this amazing chemistry. There really is so many moments that this game makes you feel like you're in the middle of a movie. This game is so approachable and I think that's one of my favorite parts about it. You can really just jump in, pick any class because they're all useful. Assault being able to smash walls down or support being able to build up walls or recon being able to use grappling hooks. There's just so many neat things about every class and I honestly rotate depending on the map that we're playing on. Another praise we have to give to the devs is that they've been extremely quick to listening to feedback from the community and posting updates very regularly. In fact, they hopped on pretty much all of the ideas Big Fry listed, which were all stellar, by the way. But like Big Fry, I also really don't have much to critique about the game. They got so much of it right. And I want to start off this video with the game breaking issues that this game has. There's none. The one quality of life thing that I do hope comes to the game soon is the ability to customize our loadout from the menu. But I can't tell you how much I love the social interactions. People seem really talkative, even if it's the opposing team. I'm gonna shot. Oh! Okay. Yeah. That was good. As soon as I turned my back. Sorry for what my It's okay. I'll see you later, buddy. You have a great. <laughs> you really just have to hand it to the devs. In my book, it's safe to say this was a perfect launch for a modern game. It's really been a breath of fresh air in today's market. There's really no other game I'm as excited to sit down and play again. And you're getting so much with this instant classic. It's the easiest 15 bucks I've ever spent. Again, this game is very, very approachable. And the charts are telling. It's just hit 60k players recently, and it's not stopping. Something I loved to do in Battlefield, you know, the game everyone keeps saying uh, this one is killing is sniping. And they're not wrong, by the way. I don't really have any desire to go back to Battlefield. I, This is fine. Even though it's a brick game, it's a Roblox look, it's still beautiful. The skybox is dope. It's like a painting. I wish there would be a little bit more contrast or shadows or lighting features. You can get lost in different hallways and basements and rooms because they're using such a minimalistic color tone. But that might be something that comes down the pipeline as the game just continues to grow and get better. But sniping feels mwah, just right. It just, ah, connecting with your shots is just too addicting. And what better way to go out than with a montage of clicking heads. I hope you liked this video even more so the game. Definitely go check it out if you haven't. And come check out the channel. I try to highlight indie games and this is definitely one I think I'll continue streaming in the future. And I do it all right here on YouTube. But I've been your Captain Void and I'll see you next time. Is there a guy over here? <laughs> Ooh, that's why you don't sit still. <laughs> Ooh.